wall just got 10 feet higher. We used to be listening to video games. We China all the time. For the first time in our channel's history, we thought we have one real channel actually bothering deciding to make a quote-unquote response video. That's right, no JD Minecraft kid, no awesome parodies, no freaking Lisa clone, it is literally a real channel, and it's a click beta. So anyway, since he changed the thumbnail like two times in a row, the first thumbnail is this. You know, if you're gonna do a video game reference over a kid named this, then making this thumbnail saying I like little kids is literally hypocritical. Like seriously, every kid I've seen watch a cartoon. With a kid protagonist, Gravity Falls is the most iconic example of that. Maybe Adventure Time? And of course he changed that thumbnail because that is clearly bloody photoshopped. So like counter 3, actually maybe 4 because he didn't even improve the thumbnails whatsoever. He changed it multiple times and he didn't improve anything, he didn't even add a background. Like if you actually put F in your freaking thumbnails, you don't have to change it bloody constantly. Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and as you may know already, I made an announcement on my other channel. Okay, that's boosted to 10. First off, where's the medical documents? Do you have any goddamn proof whatsoever? You are literally a clickbait and a liar, known for your entire goddamn history. Second, the admin literally said to his fan base that you are dead. Thirdly, you sound perfectly goddamn fine. Fourthly, you want to make the last moments of your life by making garbage clickbait videos that no one wants to watch anymore? Like you don't want to spend time with your family whatsoever, you don't want to say your last moments with your friends, all you want to do is make clickbait trash videos? Fifthly, the thumbnail does not look serious. It looks like you're 100% faking it. Cross eyes. Sixthly, you don't want to go in detail about it because it makes you cry? What? Like, people are willing to talk about that while fake crying or actually realistically crying. And, and now, I'm gonna show you guys how this YouTuber looks ridiculous. Your most liked comments in that video is literally people against you. So you failed literally trying to convince people that I'm somehow ridiculous. And I'm gonna debunk his whole exposed video on me. The video is two minutes long. You literally haven't exposed everything. Like, most of the video is, oh, I, I, I copyright strike people, even though there's no proof about that whatsoever, and I keep videos that used my videos years ago. Around. Anyway, all this guy does is basically make exposed videos on Parlo and me. Mate, did you even bother doing any research whatsoever? Those Parlo videos and that community post were made because he kept goddamn responding to me, gave me banned on other servers, threatening to sue me, claiming I'm a domestic abuser. Should I even go on? I have freaking video proof on this. Like, that's the final video I'm making on him. Like, it says final on the goddamn title. Because Polo has backed down all of his goddamn claims trying to ruin my life and literally bowed down to Faltrick saying, PLEASE LET MR NOOB TO HATE UNDERSTAND I'M NOT GONNA FRIEND OF ZOOM ANYMORE While you're still making Lisa videos, you're still making goddamn Polo videos for literally no goddamn reason. I'm not seeing any final titles there. Like literally, look up Polo number one hater and there's a bunch of proof about it. And Polo illegally striked my videos as well. What did Lisa ever do to you, Rude? Absolutely nothing. And also, I do other stuff on my channel. Does that look like a bunch of Polo and Rude videos? Like, seriously, look at this. Look at this. And I barely upload in like freaking one week or two weeks and literally don't earn any money over this. For clout. Also, he's pretty quiet right now. Oh yeah, claiming I'm quiet while claiming I'm a clout chat so that all I do is literally make videos on Polo and Words, even though that's literally not the goddamn case. If Polo did not illegally strike two of my vids and literally threatened to sue me and call me a domestic abuser, try to get me banned on other servers, and trying to censor as much people as possible, then I would have only made like three videos on Polo. That's it. Three. Like me getting banned on Polo's Discord did not even affect me whatsoever because you just take a screenshot of the announcement, boom, you're banned because you're looking at the announcements and literally saying, you know Polo's doing a stupid idea. Money and clout. It's pretty obvious. Did anyone get an ad in this video? If you you said no, you're a correct person. If you said yes, go to a hospital, you're having hallucinations. It's not goddamn obvious, you're just assuming goddamn things. Down my phone. All this guy does is just attack other YouTubers for clout, and it's obvious at this Oh yeah, you comment the vid, it's somehow attacking by commenting stuff. Somehow typing in words is somehow attacking someone. How the hell can words kill someone? Because Paul has live streams of my fan base, which are commenting him the bloody obvious that he's milking Lisa again, and he is basically not affected whatsoever. so goddamn ever, so it's not attacking. And if you're too lazy to look up Paul number one hater and literally finding that, then I'll just show it in the next video if you decide to respond to this. 
cringe. So his next claim was that I do YouTube for money when that's not even true. Then why did you leave your more road account? Right, or strikes, so is doing really well. But out of nowhere, YouTube emailed me and said my AdSense account was permanently banned. Boho, I'm leaving my 20,000 subscriber channel just because my ads are removed for good reasons because I make a god awful repetitive content. Like you're going against your own videos. If you think this is false, delete that video. Or if that's too difficult for you, private or unlist the video. Yes. I won't play his video at all because he will copyright strike me, but let's- What the hell are you talking about? I have rant videos in history that use my videos and are still up to this very goddamn day. Like this guy used my video. GD Minecraft Kid did. Even this person used my video. <laughs> Cold Kazoo Roblox Kid. And this guy as well. The list goes on. I could show a bunch of awesome parody channels that literally made videos of me saying, Oh my god, Mr. Noob the Hate is the worst, I hope he dies type of videos. Like, no one rants on me because they know I'm correct and I could screw them over massively. Because the only channels that ranted on me or quote unquote exposed me is troll channels. That's it. This is the first time a real channel decided to, you know, make this type of video and rush it out. It's obvious at this point because he makes daily community posts against my friend Parlo. Okay, first off, if Parlo's gonna keep responding to me, then yes, I'll make community posts daily about it because he's responding to me daily about it on his live streams and hiding stuff. Also, I have spies on Parlo's Discord server. You're not friends with him. Stop assuming stuff! Paul is not your friend! He literally liked a comment basically saying that you're faking lung cancer! And I'm not even gonna defend Paolo about this as well. He's literally censoring and deleting every single negative comment that's easy to make fun of or it's actually well bloody typed. Like, video proof! He was too lazy to read one comment and just delete it because it had the word, Oh, Milk and Lisa, I don't wanna hear it, oh my god, even though that's actually true. My admin was demoted. He's just a regular member for now. Because I caught him doing it. If I didn't bother uploading that video, he would have gone away with it. Because he was allowing spammers to spam him constantly to hide it. Because he had a bot that archived deleted comments, so he couldn't just delete it. So stop with the lies. Also, his video is nine minutes of just trying to roast me, so I just skipped through most of it because it's kind of cringe. Mate, I thought you were gonna debunk all my claims, but now you just said, oh, I didn't bother watching the video whatsoever, so I just assume things. You're literally doing the same tactic Paul has done. You're just accusing someone for simply making an easy to ignore video on you. I quit for six months because YouTube was gonna ban me for reports. Let me show you guys something. This screenshot proves I have a perfect standing account with no community guideline strikes whatsoever on both my channels. Where are you even getting this false information from? Your ad gone taken away. That is literally a sign that YouTube was at the brink of terminating your channel. And also, your channel being perfectly fine is not even a point. They remove the strikes in 90 days. 8 minute mark to get more money by talking about old videos and drama. Like, what the hell? Do you see any ads in this video? I already repeated this again. People for money and views. I know you love making videos on me because your most popular video has my name in it, but please stop. Anyway, I'm out of here. Be sure to subscribe and leave a like on the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Later. Like, I only made, like, three videos on you. Well, I think I missed the point that Ari is talking about Social Blade, how inaccurate it is. Oh, good. Like, Social Blade was there to show that before your ads got removed, you earned money. That was the entire point of me saying that. Like, you don't do YouTube as a hobby. You do it as a job. Like, literally uploading Lisa videos daily. And also, his Twitter is bloody awful. He's literally attacking someone for being bloody honest. Like, it's five images of it, and other YouTubers are going to be more in-depth with this because I don't use Twitter. So there we go, 40 major lies on a 2 minute short video. And I legit t done a community post on words, basically saying, if you didn't rush this, if you actually take your time and actually bother researching this, I could have unlisted and private this video and ended beef or drama with you, but this guy decided to mess his chance up. Anyways, I was gonna make an outro in this video, but this guy does not deserve an outro at all. He is literally gonna keep going on about this, so adding an outro in this video is gonna be pointless, because it's not gonna end. I'm 100% sure Roach is not gonna respond to this video whatsoever, because he knows I'm right, he knows I literally speak the facts, and he knows that I have tons of allies that's making videos on him. His most liked comments are literally negative comments. Telling him how much of a clickbaiter he is and how he milks Lisa constantly. 
Anyways, at the end of the video, I'm gonna say goodbye now. It's gonna be another part of this if he decides to respond. Anyways, goodbye. It's gonna fade out.